Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we have a very, very exciting video. Today, myself and Mello Plans will be collaborating. We will both be using this gorgeous Galaxy Girl kit from Wednesday Planning. Now you can either use List 15 or Mel 15 for 15% 15 off. And these are the full boxes. You've got your checklist, your Monday through Sunday, your to-dos, your todays, your little things, your bill dues, your Monday through Sunday, your habit trackers, your weekend banner, your half boxes, your quarter boxes, page flags, checklist, date covers, glitter headers, and your washi and your date covers. So, the reason, I guess not the reason why we're collaborating, but Mel and I both have very different styles of planning. She back plans with a no white space planning, whereas I forward plan for white space. And today we are going to swap styles. Oh, I'm I'm nervous but excited because I, when I first started planning, I was very much white space and writing a lot on the paper, and it has progressed to be more kind of half-half, where I do have a lot of stickers that I put in my planner, but to my eye it's still not as overwhelming as the non-white space planning, but I'm going to give it a go. And here are some other stickers that I will be pulling in. So we've got the kind of half boxes that will kind of match this kit, and then some more half boxes. Mellow Plans uses these for work, and because it's only I only have three days of work, I thought I could use them as well. Some more quarter boxes. Glitter headers, I've never, well I use these functionally, I've never really used them before so I thought I'd bring these in because Mellow Plans really loves using her glitter headers. So I brought those in as well. And then some other kind of icons and stuff. So got my, apart from Wednesday planning, I PR for Jessica Kate planning, and so new releases and I guess PR posting, sticker thief new releases, dogs, Instagram icons, birthdays, a flat lay that I got through a D stash that I really like, my doggies, Seppy, Wombles, Friend, Munchkins, the crate with pen, doodad, um, Stelbo Super Co games because I'll hopefully be having some game time with Dylan who's my partner, some Sticker Thief Jasmine Nom burgers and I know that I said I wouldn't really find a use for wash hair Jasmine but I think I've used it once and I want to use it again because I'm trying to take a page out of Mellow Plans' book. Uh, running Girl, Plan to Create, I love these and I thought they went really well with the kit, same with those. Fox and Cactus Girls, as always, I need to buy more, they're amazing. And we've got some Planet Beautiful Girls, Day Off, Time to Plan, Birthdays again, Happy Mail, Upload, Instagram, Food Shop, Coffee, Coffee, because no one loves her coffee, Fill Up, Change Sheets, Washing, washing, vacuum, cleaning, runners, soccer balls, and gym! My god, it's not as much as I have had in the past, but I always love pulling in things from other places as well. So sit back, relax, buckle up, because this is going to be a hell of a messy plan with me because I'm so scared. <laughs> Uh, pray for me. I just wanted to start off by apologizing. I'm so sorry that like three quarters of this video is out of fucking focus. I'm so annoyed. At least it's not like too bad so you can still kind of see what's going on but it's not until like a bit later that I realize and adjust the focus of the camera. I decided to cut the washi in half because I really wanted to use this AliExpress washi that really went with it as well. It's like purple and blue and it had like hollow stars in it. So I'm like, oh, I'll just cut the, um, the Wednesday planning washi in half. I didn't have a bow Simply Gilded washi that matched. I know that Mellow Plans does that quite a lot. She has like the thin washi and then she puts a Simply Gilded 
hearts washy over the top, but I just didn't have anything that matched, so I decided to do my own version of it, I guess. And I'm loving these hollow overlays. They're from Blackbird Print Co. They came with the Cosmic Kit or something. Give me space. I think it's called Cosmic Kit, and I wouldn't use them when I use the kit, so I'm like, oh, I'll use them as my header overlays and my flag overlays. So that still gives me enough overlays for when I use the kit because it's like space theme and it's the full box overlays are like stars and they're so freaking pretty. And then putting the headers down, I really should have like thought about this first because I put the headers down and then I put the glitter overlays and then sometimes I have to move the headers to fit other things in and so some of the glitter from the overlay like comes off. It's not too bad, but just some of the overlays only have like two stars on them and others have like 20, so it's not a huge big deal. It was weird having headers. I think in the overall look of it, it looks all right. I do decide to change up this quote box to a quote box from Black Wombat, just because I like having something that's a little bit motivating and yeah, just having nothing there is just a bit boring, I guess, and that's not really something to motivate you for the week. Kind of like having a weekly mantra or something. I'm liking having my meals and my habit trackers on the side, and I decided to not have my PR things on the side. I know that I've done that in the past recently, but I have a bit of shit to do, and with the no space, I guess, there wasn't room to put extra stuff during the week. So I'm like, oh, if I have something to do, I can just pop it there. And then I do full boxes. As much as I did enjoy doing this, my Fridays are pretty busy. And so having a full box on a Friday isn't ideal. So that's like, I think my only issue with it. If I could do it again, I would not have a full box on Friday and I think I would have enjoyed it a lot more. And it also took me a lot longer to plan, I reckon, because I had to do like sticker after sticker after sticker after sticker and I used a lot more stickers. I do wish that Wednesday Planning had more half and quarter boxes and this is something that I've chatted to her about and we'll, she will hopefully get to that after the Sydney Planner Market. As someone that uses them a lot, I, yeah, really, really like half and quarter boxes. But now that I have a silhouette machine, I can just make my own, so no big deal. <laughs> I'm more likely to buy from a shop if they have like a full page of half and quarter boxes, because that's just what I like, and everyone's different. So I place a Coffee Monday and a quarter box, then a Jessica Kate planning VIP Instagram on a quarter box, Netflix and chill, with a fox and cactus girl, and then pizza and board games on a half box, and the quarter box to do work documents. I do end up changing how my workout schedule looks for the week. I've decided that Monday will be legs day, and I'm actually filming this after I've done the workout, and I am gonna be so sore tomorrow. Dom's is real, <laughs> which is delayed onset muscle soreness for those that aren't up with the lingo. And then Tuesday, got my fitness challenge again, gym, doing some arms, I've decided, with a half box, then tea time. It was very hard to try and fit things in the little gaps, like you had to have no white space, so I used like the headers a lot, and I used them functionally as well, so I had fill up and what we're having for dinner, even though we're kind of swapping what we're having for dinner, but that's fine. And yeah, really like the Planners Anonymous Tea Time Girl and the one that I used on Monday. They're both really cute, but because it's fucking blurry, you can't fucking see. That's annoying. on Wednesday wash hair and face mask with the Jasmine washing her hair girl and the bowl type. I'm really enjoying it and I'm pretty sure that that episode is the last of the season so I'm kind of keen to see how it finishes up. I do end up moving the thing on Wednesday. I think it's the birthday because it's actually 
I thought my dog's birthday was the Wednesday, but it's actually the Monday. Bad Papa or Mum. I uh, turned three on Monday, so I now have a little bit of a spare spot on Wednesday. But we've got haul video with a plan to create Annie. I really, really like her. I like how she's very simplistic and she's holding a cute little YouTube. And then on Thursday, I use washi tape to create a kind of quarter box and put time to plan. And then I have my planner, some tea from Pomegranate's Pins and Prints with Chai Time, new releases from Jessica Kate Planning, another Kayla workout, burgers for dinner, even though I think we're swapping that around as well. <laughs> Friday, I need to run errands, actually go for a run. Uh, Sick of Eat new releases is on Fridays. Lunch with Dylan, who's my partner, and I absolutely love these munchkins. Like, they just really resonate with me, like our relationship, so I, I really like them. Not that I would wear a bow or anything, but I just think that they're really cute. Just mucking around and like annoying each other and stuff. Then I've got laundry, which is a stick with bonbon washing machine, a very kawaii washing machine with laundry from Monique Plans. I'm pretty sure that's like silver, looks really cute. Ree's body shop party, I'm pretty sure that's canceled, so might just do a bit of a swap after I film the video to make sure that things are planned correctly and then I want to edit and upload on Sunday. I really need to start getting my butt into gear with uploading on Sundays. The last couple of weeks I've, as you can probably tell, I've uploaded on Monday because I just haven't had the time. Saturday want to do another Kayla session which is arms and abs and using Florence from Jessica Kate Planning. I really really like her. She's a bit long but I think if she was any smaller you just couldn't see her detail so I'm really really happy with her. And then we want to go to the dog park with our two doggies. Probably do a half hour of power cleaning and using a little mop and bucket from Hamilton Print Co and meal prep on Saturday night. I really need to start meal prepping again and eating healthy. There's a Facebook group for like fitness planner pals or something and I really want to start getting myself motivated. Like I'm a physio, I need to be like a good role model for health. And at the moment I'm still making that journey. And then I play Cobram away. So we're having a road trip there and changing sheets on Sunday. I sent Mel a message today being like, oh, you know, I'm gonna do my planning today. And she's like, oh, are you gonna do a chatty one or a voiceover one? And always voiceover. Just because if I plan not with a voiceover. I don't know how it would go. Let's have a look. This is how I store my stickers in these. And maybe something like, you got this girl. Look for rainbows when it's dark. And the good thing is, Wednesday planning paper is well, it's not unicorn paper premium, but it is removable. So I planned with vinyl and that was removable, but I hated writing with a sharpie and I just don't really like the feel of vinyl. Whereas this is removable and it's not vinyl. I almost think that one works the best. Do you guys like my sped up? videos because I, I do it this way because A, I prefer to plan like that. I don't like being distracted. I like getting my planning done. And I think if I was doing two things at once, I think I would get, um, like now, my brain is struggling to do more than one thing at a time. In physio, we have this uh, outcome measure, so like a standardised test that we do with people, and we need to count the number of steps people are taking over a 10 metre walkway, and I can't 
count steps as well as talk to people. So it's it's really funny. They try and chat to me. Like when I first started, they tried to chat to me and whatever. Even though it's only like 10 meters, I'm like, look, I'm really sorry. Like I've got to concentrate and count your steps. And also um, make notice of how they're walking. Like if they've got um, a foot drop or whether they're putting more weight on one leg when they're walking and stuff. I can't do more than one thing at a time. My brain just shuts down. So maybe, I'll, maybe I'm meant to be a guy. Like, there is that joke that guys can't do more than one thing at a time, but I'm definitely like that, unfortunately. All right, this is now the final spread. Definitely won't change the way I plan to this specifically, but I definitely like like it's not too busy and I do like how I did this. I'm not sure whether that's white space playing or not. As you can see, I've got two birthdays. One of them's my dog, one of them's my partner's sister. I don't remember which one's which. So, I just have to confirm and don't want to put it in and get it wrong. It's bad enough that I don't know. This washi, it's a little bit strange. It's from AliExpress and I guess because of the foil detail, it's got like this backing to it. Probably saw it earlier in the video. But it's got like this clear backing, but it's all 80 or something, including postage. Like, I'm so chuffed. It's so pretty. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video, and be sure to check out Mellow Plans' version. I can't wait to see how she plans using my style, because, like, it's only a little bit of a jump to go from mine to this, compared to her planning style to mine. Like, it's a big difference so it'll be really interesting to see how she goes. Alright thanks so much for watching guys see you guys in the next one. Catch you later.